you guys are our heroes, and God bless you and your families. I uh, wrote this song a few years ago with Brad Paisley, and uh, this is my daughter's, my oldest daughter's favorite song, and uh, it goes something like this. To the teller down at the bank, just another checking account. To the plumber that came today, well, you're just another house. The airport ticket counter, you're just another fare. At the beauty shop at the mall, well, you're just another head of hair. And that's all right, and that's okay. If you don't feel important, well, honey, all I got to say is to the world, you may be just another girl, but to me, well, baby, you are the world. To the waiter at the restaurant, you're just another tip. To the guy at the ice cream shop, well, you're just another dip. You can't get reservations cause you didn't have the clout. Or you didn't get an invitation cause somebody left you out. Well, that's all right, and that's okay. If you don't feel important, well, honey, all I got to say is to the world. You may be just another girl But to me Well, baby, you are the world You say you're one of millions But you're one in a million to me And if you wonder if you matter, baby, look into my eyes and tell me, can't you see? You're everything to me. And that's all right. And that's okay. If you don't feel important, well, honey, all I got to say is to the world. You may be just another girl But to me Well, baby, you are the world Congratulations, sir. Hi everyone, my name is Mitch Bainwall. I'm the CEO of the Recording Industry Association of America, and I'm also a board member of NFI. And you got a, a little bit of a sense of lead today. He's done obviously three songs. He is a master storyteller. Uh, he can make you cry, he can make you laugh, he can inspire you. And what you probably don't know is that he's become one of America's great storytellers. He is maybe one of the most significant songwriters of our generation. So, uh, Lee, thank you so much for sharing your gift, your talent. You also probably don't know that what makes Lee special is that he's an even better dad than he is a writer. Um, Lee and his wife, Jana, have four kids, three of whom he welcomed into his home after birth. And uh, it's a great story. He's a guy who's a wonderful patriot, obviously a great creative talent, and just a wonderful American. So, Lee, you're a great dad, and I'm uh, very proud to present you with a Fatherhood Award for 2010. Thank you. You know, I, wow, I mean, I'm so undeserving on so many levels. I, you know, I immediately think back to what I said to him this morning before I left when they were doing something <laughs> ridiculous. And, and the irony is my wife was coming with me and she gets to the airport in time for the babysitter to call and say, the seven-year-old has a fever and a tummy ache. How that happens from the house to the airport, I don't know. And, 
but she's not here. I, I, I'm, I'm humbled, and, uh, and, and again, congratulations to you, and, and thank you for, for this wonderful organization. I mean, I, I'm, I'm not, I don't, <laughs> I go to work every day and find things to rhyme with love. I mean, seriously, and, and you guys go chase the bad of the bad guys, and I'm, I'm, I'm humbled to be here, but thank you, thank you very much. Thank you.